West Hollywood may soon become a more expensive place to park a car. The city might extend the hours parking meters are active and eliminate free parking on Sundays. Valley View News reporter Andre Martinez joins us from the newsroom with more on the controversial plan. And it's a controversial proposal indeed. The city says the plan will help free up parking spaces for short-term parkers and the extra revenue will pay for security for the city. But some people say it's just a money grab. People may have to feed their meters more often in West Hollywood to avoid a parking ticket. The city is considering extending the hours of more than 2,000 parking meters. The new plan would require meters to be fed four to eight hours longer each day and eliminate free parking on Sundays. The Transportation Commission hopes to submit the new parking meter proposal by November, but some people don't want to have to deal with these meters more than they already have to. I'm not happy about it. There's too many ways for the city to rip off the average consumer here. They're looking to squeeze every nickel, every penny that they could find from the people who live in the community. Some businesses fear the changes will hurt their bottom line. Restaurant manager Roberto Hernandez says the lack of a parking lot makes them vulnerable. I think it will hurt the business because more um, people will not park. They'd uh, rather look for like establishment that provide parking. Opponents of the plan say extended metered parking would leave spaces open for short-term parkers to slide in and out and can cut the city's traffic congestion by 30 percent. WeHo parking operations manager Jackie Rocco says more metered parking means more customers for businesses. We have a lot of businesses in West Hollywood that rely on parking meters for all their parking needs because they don't have any off-street parking and by keeping enforcing those meters um, until the hours of operation that the businesses are open, we get that kind of turnover. Because of the many visitors that West Hollywood attracts, some residents will reluctantly accept the change. Well, I'd like to pay less for parking, but I certainly understand the reasons for doing it um, because this is a popular place to come. The city council predicts the extended hours will generate $1 million in annual revenue. Rocco says the monies will be used to make the city safer. Again, it's for increased security citywide, so all of the monies um, that will be generated from these extended hours will go right back into the community. If adopted, the plan will go into effect early next year. WeHo is waiting on the results of a survey sent out to businesses on whether they would support the proposal. The city would also phase in the new hours over a two-month period to give people enough time to adjust.